Hi everyone, my name is Kiki Swan, and today we're going to talk about dwarf mongoose, or Pelagale parvola. Dwarf mongoose live on the east side of Africa. They live in forests, open woodlands, thickets, wooded savannas, and semi-arid areas. They are the smallest carnivore in Africa at 7 to 11 inches long and weighing at 1 pound. Dwarf mongooses eat mostly insects, including beetles and grasshoppers, though they may also eat spiders, scorpions, small vertebrates, eggs, and fruit. Mongooses have an advanced vocabulary. This is put to good use by their sentry. Dwarf mongoose have a good lookout that watches for a slew of predators, including birds of prey, jackals, snakes, slender mongoose, and other carnivores. They will cheep, cheep, cheep to let everyone know that it's safe to emerge from the tunnels and even have a cheep, cheep, cheep for predators of the ground or the sky. These guys will live in termite mounds and in groups known as a business with around 2 to 21 individuals. The females are dominant and have a dominant partner. Most businesses include the dominant pair's offspring and even immigrant mongooses. Immigrant mongooses usually have a better chance at becoming the next dominant successor. In order to claim the position of dominant female, the females do not fight, but instead have a grooming contest. They'll groom each other and cover the other in their saliva. The one to endure this grooming the longest is the new dominant. The longest contest recorded took four days. Their lifespan varies wildly in the wild from 2 to 8 years, but they can live up to 18 years in managed care.
These mongoose have a relationship with insect-eating birds including hornbills, drongos, and lilac-breasted rollers. These birds will eat insects that the mongoose will dig up and in return, the birds will act as additional sentries. They'll sound an alarm and fly away if danger is present, but it has also been observed that these birds will call an alarm for dwarf mongooses for predators that pose no threat to the bird. The birds also act as an alarm clock for the mongooses and will call out down to the mongoose dens to wake the critters up so they can forage for food together. Interestingly, on the other hand, if the mongooses notice that the birds are missing, they'll be agitated, relentless, and will even send individuals out to check on the missing birds. Dwarf mongooses will attack and even kill snakes. They rely on their agility and thick coats to prevent injury from snake bites. The whole business will gather around a snake and harass and mob it until it's exhausted and that's when the dominant female comes in and kills it by biting its spinal cord behind the head. Snakes are the only prey that is shared amongst the business. Mongooses are diurnal, which means that they sleep during the night and spend the day foraging for insects. They wake up and come out of their burrows to sunbathe and warm up from the night's cold. According to the ICNU, dwarf mongoose are classified as least concern as they are very common and fortunately have no present ecological threats. They are one of the most common of the mongoose species. Thank you so much for watching Kiki's Fun Animal Cam. If you enjoyed this, please give us a like, a comment, and a subscribe. Please share this video to your friends so that way they can learn about fun animals as well. Stay tuned next time for the next episode of Kiki's Fun Animal Facts. Have a great day. Bye.